Hey guys, Mohammed here again. So I am a huge, huge fan of Amazon's Echo Dot smart speaker and love the Alexa personal assistant. Whether it be playing my favorite songs, asking for the latest news or checking my calendar, the speaker on the Echo Dot is awesome. But the only issue here is that I can't take this product with me on the go as it needs a constant power supply. Especially on a hot summer's day, this device would be great to take with you when you're in the park with family and friends. However, when GGMM reached out to me asking to review their D4 Echo Dot 4th gen battery base, I knew I had to test this out and see if it truly works. In today's video, we're going to be unboxing, testing and reviewing the GGMM D4 Echo Dot battery base and see if this product is truly worth purchasing. But before we do that, as always guys, if you enjoyed today's video or found it helpful, then please hit that like and subscribe button to support your boy, I'd really appreciate that. Now without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So the GGMM D4 is basically a battery base for your Echo Dot 4th generation smart speaker, which allows you to take your device with you on the go. The D4 has a 5200 milliamp power supply, which can last up to 6 hours of playtime at full volume before the battery dies. The charge time takes roughly around 3.5 hours to complete, which isn't too bad, and the built-in smart charging chip allows longer usage without damaging the battery. Finally, from a fitment perspective, the battery base integrates perfectly with the Echo Dot and doesn't take too long to set up and install. In regards to the product breakdown, the device weighs roughly around 450 grams, which is super light, and has a height of 5 centimeters. The material is made from plastic, which feels pretty strong and solid. On front, you have the power button, as well as the LED indicator lights, which tell you the charge level remaining. And finally, towards the back, you have the device input, which is used to power your Echo Dot. In terms of packaging, on front, you have the company logo, as well as an image of the D4 battery base. On top, you have some product and company information. And finally, on the sides, you have an image again. Inside the box, you get the GGMM D4 battery base, as well as one pair of wipes, one magnet to connect your Echo Dot and battery base firmly in place, and finally, a user manual on how to set up. The setup process is pretty straightforward. Start by removing the adhesive from the magnet, and then connect the magnet to your battery base. Insert your Echo Dot into the battery base, and then hold the power button for two seconds. If your device is still not booting, Charge the battery base via charge input using your existing cable. Once fully charged, you should be good to go from here. Now for some testing. Whilst having the radio play in the background, the device would last roughly around 5-6 to six hours with the volume at 100% and 6-7 to seven hours while the volume was at 50%. Finally, when the device was idle, the battery base would last roughly around 14-15 to 15 hours until the battery had fully died. Before we summarize guys, if you found today's video helpful or just simply enjoyed watching it, please show your boy some love by hitting that like button below. Your likes really do help support the channel and it really does mean a lot to me. Now, let's get back to the video. Overall, the GGMM D4 is a great product if you're looking to take your Echo Dot with you on the go. The device has a long battery life and doesn't take a huge amount of time to fully charge. The D4 is ideal for places where power outlets are not easily accessible and is super easy to set up in order to have your Echo Dot up and running in no time. In regards to pricing, you can pick up the GGMM D4 Echo Dot accessory from Amazon for around £35 and you can find the link to purchase in the description below. But that's all from me guys. What are your thoughts on the GGMM D4 and is this something that you would purchase? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I'm Mohammed from Tekka Reviews and I'll see you all in the next video.